assumed you asked me the question, what is considered a good carb as opposed to a bad carb? And I try to make it as easy as possible to remember this because knowing these things can get very, very detailed and frustrating and most people give up. And I try to make it very simple and straightforward. So let's get into it. A bad carb versus a good carb. The reason why you want to know the difference is because a bad carb will cause your glucose to go up, glucose levels to go up immediately or within five minutes and that's not a good thing to do it will not be able to level off in a gradual state a good carb allows your glucose to go up in a gradual state and keep it consistent for a main or maintain that consistency level for a good point of time if you're doing a bad carb it'll spike your glucose levels or index but then have it come crashing down and that's not good for your system any system that does that or you have them ups and downs so sporadically is not good for your system. So think about it this way. If you drink something, you have an Oreo cookie, which is one of my favorites, but I digress. I will feel a burst of energy or my glucose levels goes up immediately within minutes. But if I have something more substantial or more nutritional, as far as uh, brown rice, I can eat it, but my glucose level index do not peak like that it'll just gradually go to a stable healthier level so think about it that way spiking or not to spike that is the question and you do not want your glucose levels to spike you want it to stay consistent throughout your day that way it allows you to feel more energized throughout your day without crashing i hope this helps and a very good question what is the difference between a good carb and a bad carb talk to you guys soon god bless bye bye